Hi guys! Today, we are going around a brand new Tunnels for Sale in Mandaluyong City. But before we start, please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the bell button so you will be notified whenever we release new content. Please like us on Facebook and add us to your new speed favorites. Follow us on Instagram and TikTok at mapletree.ph. My name is Dara and welcome to another Maple Tree house tour. This property has a total floor area of 355 to 365 square meters more or less and a total lot area of 90 to 95 square meters more or less. So here you will find your four-car garage. Come on guys, follow me as we check out the entire property. Okay, so for the whole development, you have some CCTV cameras for your safety. And then here you will find your cistern and your dirty kitchen, auxiliary kitchen, and your service area. Okay, so you can also put your washer and dryer over on this side. Okay, so come on guys. Some of the units, they converted a bigger receiving area on the ground floor. So they only have three car garage. You can do that also, but at your expense. Come on guys. So here you will find your Tangile solid wood door. Okay, so you have a manual lock. Come on, follow me guys. So as you enter the house, come on. So here you will find your staff quarters. Okay, so pardon the things inside. And then you have some large windows here. Okay, for added light and ventilation, it also has a sliding screen. Okay, check that out. Okay, so to keep the insects outside your home. Okay, so the yayas are also protected from dengue. Okay, so here is their common toilet and bath. So come on guys. So it's complete with bathroom fixtures. Okay, so they can take a shower here already. Okay, with windows for added light and ventilation. See? So there are laminated wood for the doors inside the house. So as we head up, here this is narrow wood for your flooring for the staircase. And also tempered glass over here and narrow handrails. Come on guys! Okay, so on the second floor, you will find your living and your dining space here. Okay, so it's an open concept. You have some cove ceiling and cove lighting here. You can also put a nice chandelier if you want to. So as you can see, it's very maaliwalas. There are a lot of windows, a lot of um, added light. Okay, the room is well lit. And then they have sliding windows here and over there para tagusan yung hangin. Okay, so it keeps the room cool. Okay, so here on this part is your clean kitchen. Okay, so this is your main kitchen. As you can see, you have a U-shaped counter here. It's all modular cabinets for the kitchen. As you can see, you have a lot of storage spaces. Here, you have twin sinks. Okay, so hindi kailangan mag-agawan when you wash the dishes. You also have a table here. This can be a breakfast nook or for your staff to have their lunch and dinner and breakfast as well. And then over on this part is for your stove. You also have a range hood included when you buy the house. Okay, and then this part can be for your two-door refrigerator. Okay, and then more overhead cabinets here for your pantry, for your grocery items, and under-the-counter cabinets as well. part you have a door so this door leads to the fire exit as you can see and it leads you to the garage okay come on guys so when you buy the house the air conditioning units are included 
The appliances are not except for the range hood. Okay, so you have a Daikin inverter air con here. Okay, so come on guys, on this part, this you can put a study here. Okay, so that's your living area. This one, you can put more shelves if you need more storage area. Or you can also set up some study area here. Okay, if you need to, if you have kids studying. Okay. And then here is another storage room under the stairs. So this one, guys, pasok tayo kasi malaki to. So you have all the wearing going there. Okay. So, you have a lot of storage space there. And then, this is the powder room. Okay. So, for this powder room, you have your wash basin, your water closet. You have a soap holder here. Okay, so you also have a vanity here. So, the tiles are homogeneous tiles. Okay, and there are tiles all over the walls as well. So, it's complete. Okay, let's now head up and check out the other bedrooms. Okay. Okay, so as we head up, we have put some lights here so to keep the stairs well lit. Okay, and then these woods are narrow wood. It's a solid wood, it's not just a narrow planks. Okay, and then you have again you have tempered glass here. But as you arrive on the third floor, the flooring here is narrow wood planks already. Okay, and now let's check out the first bedroom of the house, which is the master bedroom. Come on, guys. So as you head inside, you have an L-shaped built-in cabinets here. I wanted to show you these because you have a lot of storage spaces inside. So you have your hanging rods there. Okay, you have big cabinets. Okay, and it's soft close as you can see. You can put your luggages there. Okay, for those of you who loves to travel, I'm sure you have a lot of luggages. Okay, so you have more here, more shelves here. This one also, as you can see, and more hanging rods on this side. So as you can see, you have a lot of space. You have massive space here for your master bedroom. You have your cove ceiling, your cove lighting as well. So this room can fit a lot of things, okay? It can fit your king-size bed, a lounge chair, a sofa. You can put a relaxing area here. So just put a big TV and a sofa here so, you know, you can enjoy and relax in your own bedroom. Okay. So here you also have life-size windows, okay? almost floor-to-ceiling glass windows with screen as well. Okay? So to keep the insects outside your home, to avoid dengue or mosquito bites. Okay, come on guys, let's check out the ensuite toilet and bath. So here, you have some marble-like tiles, as you can see. Okay, and then you have some his and her sinks. Okay, you have large windows. What else can you see? Okay, you have some cabinets here. Okay, for your storage. Okay, so this one is a cabinet. Drawers. Okay. Soft clothes. And then you have also an enclosed shower space. So, okay, complete with bathroom pictures. You have your rain shower head, your telephone shower head here, and your faucet on this part. Okay, where you can put your shampoo and your other conditioner, you know, to keep your hair shine. 
Hey, you have an exhaust class, a big window for ventilation and added light. Okay, let's now head to the second bedroom of the house. Come on, guys. Follow me here. So, walang hallway, walang tapon, maximizing space. Okay, so come on, guys. So, on this second bedroom, this can be a guest room or for your kids. Okay, it's smaller than the master bedroom, of course. You have a Daikin inverter aircon included when you buy the house. Okay, so you also have some cabinets here. So you have some shelves for your storage. And this is the ensuite toilet and bath. Let's check out the other door later. So here you have a semi enclosed shower space, of course, complete with shower fixtures as well. You also have a Panasonic water heater included, as you can see. Okay, so you have vanity, you have your wash basin, your water closet, your soap holder. So it's complete. You also have an exhaust. So what's good thing about this bathroom for all the bathrooms, they have exhaust plus a window for ventilation. So sometimes when you do a warm shower, even if after taking a bath, paglabas mo, Pawis na pawis ka, init, diba? So, at least, may exhaust na, may window pa. Okay, and then on this part, come on guys. So here, you have a balcony, okay, for the room. You can set up some coffee table here for two people. If you wanna relax, you want fresh air, pwede tumambay dito. And then, it also doubles as your access, going down as your fire exit. Follow me as we check out the other parts of the house. So let's head up to the fourth floor. So guys, if you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel, please do so and we will appreciate your love and support. Okay, so as we head up, let's check out this room first. So this is the third bedroom of the house. This bedroom is bigger than the second bedroom, if you notice. So here, you will find your built-in cabinets. Okay, so my light inside, it will automatically turn on when you open the cabinets. You have some hanging rods here. Okay, you saw that, right? And then, you have multiple drawers with soft clothes. Okay, large windows. You also have a balcony. Okay. A little smaller than the one on the third floor. But you can set up a small table here as well, coffee table. Again, your access to the fire exit. And your ensuite, toilet and bath. You also have a Daikin inverter aircon included. So here naman, it's an enclosed shower space. So the difference with a second bedroom, second bedroom is just semi-enclosed, but for this one, it's really enclosed. Okay, I'm going inside for you to have a reference of the size. Okay, it's enough for you to take a shower, relaxing shower. And you have complete with bathroom pictures and a bathroom niche here as well. Okay, again, your wash basin, your vanity, and mirror here. And of course, your exhaust fan. Okay. So let's go, guys. So on this part, as we head out, this can be your family area. Okay, this one can also be your little library, okay, or your study. Totally up to you. But you can also put a large TV here. So if you want your kids to bond, to watch movies together at home, especially when it's pandemic, you don't want them to go out and watch movies, right? 
You just, you know, have some snacks here. Let your imagination work. Put an L-shaped sofa or just a sofa here and watch the movie from your home. Okay? And then, this is the fourth bedroom of the house. So for this part, guys, para hindi sayang, just to give you an idea, you can put a cabinet here as well para, you know, there's ample space for your storage as well. Okay, come on, guys. So, we are now in the fourth bedroom of the house. So as you can see, the size is also massive. Okay, so this can fit a king-size bed on this part. And there's a bang already. You can put two side tables on either side with your lampshade or if you need to charge your phone. And of course, life-size windows here. Just put on your curtains, okay? Para my privacy. So yeah, okay? So you also have your screens to protect you from insects. side, you have your built-ins, okay, so the light automatically turn on as well, and then the texture, guys, may ano na siya, it has a wallpaper for the cabinets, okay, let's check this out, so more hanging rods here, and of course, your ensuite, toilet and bath, so here, you also have a Daikin inverter aircon, okay? So that's included when you buy the house. Okay, and then on this part, so wash basin, you have more cabinets here for your storage, for your bathroom cleaning materials, windows, and the shower area is on this part, guys. Okay, in this corner naman. So the same shower pictures, bathroom niche, it's an enclosed shower space. Okay, that's about it. So now, let's head down for a recap. To recap, this property has a total floor area of 355 to 365 square meters more or less and a total lot area of 90 to 95 square meters more or less. You have four car garage, you have the living, the dining, and the main kitchen. You have your auxiliary kitchen in the laundry area or the service area. You have four bedrooms with their own toilet and bath. This property is located in Mandaluyong City. It is very near SM Cherry and also schools such as Savior School, Immaculate Conception Academy. If you would like to schedule an ocular visit with us, please call us through the numbers below. Again, my name is Dara of Maple Tree, a multi-awarded real estate brokerage, and your broker of choice. See you soon! Bye-bye!